Hi guys. Hi everyone. Another topic for today with the videos. Yes. Uh, watch. You're gonna love this. <laughs> it's why lighting. Lighting. Yes, yeah. lighting. <laughs> why lighting? Wow. So yeah, we'll start off. Why lighting? Lighting. Lighting is the most interesting part of everybody's life, guys. Without light, I don't think you can sit in your living room. That's good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So lighting plays a very important role in the decorating any particular part of the house. For example, let it be kitchen, living, hall, dining or whatever the place. So what today we are going to discuss is the different types of lighting. For example, to lit a wall, what type of light we should go with. For example, to lit particular dining, what kind of light. For example, if it's a breakfast counter, what light do we suggest on the breakfast counter. So in detail, we will be discussing today. Okay, good. Yeah. So, what are the value additions? Why a customer should go for mm -hmm. lighting, special lighting in his house, other than the usual traditional fluorescent lights? Mm -hmm. Why should he go for special lighting? Uh, see, uh, see, Aaron, more or less like uh, the current generation people, right? Uh, what they feel is, for example, the grandparents, they want to live with a warm lighting. And for a kid who is studying in his bedroom, he want a fluorescent light. I mean, the throw off light should be more. And the people who are watching the TV in their bedroom while sleeping, they want to have a co-lighting, which is additional ambience. So different mood needs different lighting. So you mean to say so what, ambience? what we are saying now is in the present generation, we do not have to just compromise on what regular CFL bulbs. Other than that, we have much more. So you mean to say ambience yeah. is the most important thing yes. you are adding on to? Yes. Okay. So to add on to ambience, what mm -hmm. are the different types of light? that you use in your designs and See, what are and, they? Uh, to answer the questions i think i have uh, just selected a couple of photos so that the okay, clients nice. can understand it in a more better way okay. so this is one of the fall ceiling uh, design which we have done for the dining come the living room what we have done is we have divided the space into lining and living okay so what we have done is here we have provided something called as co-lighting okay so when the, whenever they are having their dining with the guests around the ceiling itself will give them a restaurant feel. Okay, that's a very cozy kind yeah, of Yeah, feel. cozy okay. feeling. So yeah. they can uh, pro probably, for example, this is one of the bedrooms which we have designed in which uh, we have used the parabolic shape in the ceiling also wherein we have provided a co-lighting. See okay. here we have turned off the spotlight. So okay. There is a provision for both the spotlight as well as a co-light. But this co-light we have provided with the blue light. If you can see here, yeah. the throw of light is blue. Okay. So that feeling, it depends on the person to person again. Okay, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So if you want to see, uh, this is again, you can see here, we have used the white light, but since the wallpaper is blue in color, that is, I mean, it is highlighting the wallpaper, the look and feel. Okay. It is one of the living rooms, in fact. Okay. If you can see here in the rafters, uh, here we have provided the spotlights. Okay. And the wooden uh, rafters here, we have provided the white lighting. So that's, if you can see here, the stones are lit by using wonderful spotlights. Okay. So okay. if you just provide a stone lighting, it will not have that wow feeling. The minute you provide this spotlights and all those, you'll get okay. that wow feeling. So what is the, what is the kind of light that is being used for the spotlights or uh, the strip? The See, uh, most of the time we suggest uh, our clients to go along with the LED lights LED, one okay. is because of the power usage okay okay and LED lights the advantage is the lifespan of the LED lights is more when compared to the regular CFLs and also if there is a damage to the LED lights it can be easily replaced by using the just the adopters not the light okay so, so you mean to say lights last long it's only the adapters that get Damage. Yeah, for example, in LED lights. Okay. And okay. even in case if there is a fluctuation of the lights, the adapter is one which gets affected but not the light. Okay. That's good. So, another interesting thing that mm. uh, people generally use is chandeliers. Mm. So, where exactly and why <laughs> chandeliers? See, chandelier, uh, for example, you have lots of guests coming in for one of your. Uh, different function or anything like that and especially when you have this double height side hall 
to let the particular ceiling what we suggest is to go ahead with the chandeliers okay i mean to i mean it itself gives a beauty to the entire ceiling okay okay and also the kind of crystals you can play around with the chandelier you'll you'll not be able to play around with the regular lights okay so you generally suggest a very big chandelier mm-hmm. in like duplex and it is one of the way to express our richness <laughs> okay that's generally people do yes <laughs> yes that's good yeah uh, so you use led strip lights also for color yes okay that's good so that's a very uh, you See, have some um, one of the lights which we generally suggest on the dining table or even in the breakfast counter is this kind of an hanging lights where most of the time we suggest the stepwise lights is our okay. banyan light i mean they can go along with the designer lights and also if at all if they want to go along with the chandelier they can okay probably okay so this is a very nice thing around the fan yeah yeah well, it does a light on the fan also right yeah yeah there's a light on the fan also <laughs> okay so different types of lighting that's very good mm-hmm. so what brands do you suggest for the lights see uh, light wise i don't think i'm the right person to comment on the brands however i'll just uh, tell our customers a few brands which are uh, very good in the market for example havels wipro philips and if price is your priority then you can go for the uh, tier 2 kind of a brands like pasolight and uh, others okay okay that's a very good information on lightings mm-hmm. with mm-hmm. very good images mm-hmm. all this executed mm-hmm. by us yes uh, of course uh, well so to sum it up to conclude mm-hmm. uh, i would say lighting mm-hmm. is for decoration and to build up the ambience mm-hmm. it is to lit the wallpapers the stone cladings to make them look more beautiful mm-hmm. and to add on to the total entire beauty of the house and the different colors of light you use you said it's blue it's warm yellow white yellow white. yeah okay there are different shades in yellow white and all that also mm-hmm. dim so you can uh, increase the brightness and all that in the yes. lighting yeah that's good so the brands that we usually suggest is halfley wipro philips and pasolite and uh, that's it guys uh, so led another important point point is uh, we have to replace only the adapters it's it's yeah if if there is a damage in the light definitely light also okay but that. it is uh, very <laughs> likely that uh, yeah. a lot of times you know, the damage happens with the adapter not with the light yes that's a very good information watch yeah i think we have covered uh, most of the things with uh, lighting guys of course i'm not covering the commercial projects here because we are uh, into the residential mostly So for more videos of Bonito Designs please log on to our website www.bonito.in bye bye bye